Uh, we left this morning real calm, beautiful camp. But as we got into the valley and gained a little elevation, the wind started coming up, and we had a tremendously hard time uh, going up a, a series of waterfalls and boulders. Uh, at first, it didn't look like it was possible we could get the sleds up there, but we worked one sled at a time and worked a full day. Uh, it took us about eight, nine hours to get everything up. And Today was pretty extraordinary, epic, as some would say. We climbed through some huge boulders that um, sprinkled around the Weasel River, which dropped quite a few feet down from Summit Lake and uh, pushed the dog teams up through it. It took all hands on deck, pushing, shoving, flipping, sliding over glare ice and over boulders. And we all came out with quite a few bruises. We made it up the waterfall. It was an absolutely um, virtuous uh, ascent. And we made it about a quarter mile past when the wind started. And uh, we have been buffeted by the winds ever since. We're the winds are blowing maybe, I don't know, 55, 60, maybe 70 miles an hour with some of the gusts, but uh, it's, we don't have much shelter uh, from the wind. We're pretty much taking it full force here. By the time we got to the top, the uh, wind was really blowing. The wind was picking up all day long, uh, blowing a kind, of, kind of a combination of uh, snow and sand. Um, about 40, 50 mile hour winds to the V that were the V, kind of a valley very narrow gorge that we were in, and uh, everybody's really exhausted tonight. It was one foot in front of the other, um, leading the dogs most of the time on a leash, actually, just to uh, keep them pointed uh, into the wind and on the ice. They tended to want to go up into the rocks. Vincent, come on, help us! There was no snow anywhere we could find. It was all ice. Um, it was very difficult for the dogs. They were um, slipping and sliding. We were also slipping and sliding. Uh, but we're able to get all the teams to the top. It took us about four hours to go, probably a quarter mile or so. Now it's time for check the energy bar. One, two, three. Ah. So it was pretty intense, and um, but also pretty satisfying to be able to do it in full two all in one piece. All's well. We're having some fun and some not so much fun. So this is Will here. I hope the reception is okay and you got this full message. Uh, really windy day here, March 18th, uh, up at the Pinkerton Valley. Over and out.